G'day guys, M Tintan here. Today we're going to learn about the Bloom post-processing tools within Maya, Octane Maya. So uh, here we have the Octane post-processor, and I have my render from my camera image tutorial, which I did a few seconds ago. If we press Enable, oh, so the um, Octane post-processor was in the uh, camera settings, so press the camera body and click on Enable. And as you can see, we have a misappropriated lens flare. Yeah, they're very rendering. Alright, so back to business. Uh, let's click on the camera body, click back in, and we can mess around with the settings, the balloon power. Like I said, the sliders are overpowered to hell. Alright, um, so that's the bloom power, the glare power, that creates a lot, five, whoa, the ray count, uh, well this, at least this one's not overpowered, um, that continues the uh, glares, glare angle, spinning it, and the glare blur. It doesn't have the new options such as the spectral um, amount and spectral quality that's in the next one um, but it's a pretty good oh it renders down, that's the reason why that's understandable so let's just quickly move around the scene and it renders into it, that's, that's nice, that's clever so that's the camera image for you. Um, have fun with it. There's always some glare and all sorts of photography. And I'll see you next time.